for the last, mm -hmm. I don't know how long, like four sets or something. I mean, he could have been player two, like yeah, yeah, just going with the P1, P2 signs. All right, and here we go. Oh, there we go again. Oh, Dark, Arts. Dark Arts. Thankfully for Salted Bread, they are not as effective yes. at the start of T. Yeah, but, but both Dark Arts and Four Wide are like this. Like you can certainly build up enough zone meter to to, to have it ready to go to overturn all the damage you could get from those. Okay, right. as 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 someone not as familiar with Tetris, what are the Dark Arts? What does that mean? Uh, the Dark Arts oh are God, a certain God, class of God, openers God, that God. are um, extremely strong and like. You know, it's like, we kind of consider it cheap to use those. Not, not truly cheap, but it's like not a surprise that you'll see someone like suddenly uh, go and use it. Like, uh, for example, the last time I popped online for Puyo Tetris Ranked, just about every opponent I faced used it, and I, I was like the only one that wasn't using it. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. So it's like not a surprise that people have bought in so what you're telling me is you're not playing to win. Yeah, that, that's what happened. To, <laughs> that's what happened to me tonight. It's more like, you know, you could pick Street Fighter Two Akuma or not, and you know, if you do pick him, you're a little bitch. <laughs> wow. A at least wow. in at least in this particular particular case, I would be using Dark Arts against a Dark Arts user, and. In, in order to really outperform them, I would have to run it faster, but I'm not a very fast player, so... I see. Yeah, it's hard. It's, uh, so in that sense, I just play things differently by running a different setup. And, and that means a different interaction. Yeah, it's just generally, like, the output and, like, board position you get from those openers are so good that... Uh, it's, you can't really counter it. Unless you use that same type of openers. Gotta mm -hmm. fight fire with fire. That's right. Pretty much. All right. But the, the, the way I handle it is the openers I play it, it tend to be effective against those that uh, that, that are useful for, tr uh, for triggering perfect clears, which the Dark Arts falls under. And so when I use the setups that I do, I'm actively looking to prevent the, those perfect clears. All right. The, the first round there ended uh, over in the second phase. I wonder if this one's going to be longer. Yeah, Salty got overwhelmed by Baseball Boys APM. That's right. It, it, it was pretty good APM too. It was, oh, it, it, he had like he had like 85 dro uh, drops per minute and about 80-ish APM. Oh wow, that's pretty good. Yeah, so pretty efficient. Ooh, Salted wastes his own. Baseball oh. Boy will not let that go through. Mm -hmm. Salted is not being very efficient either right now, so he's gonna not be able to offset a lot of Baseball Boy's zone damage. So Baseball Boy is being a bit, you know, doing Baseball Boy things. Well, it's the it's phase three that counts, so maybe maybe he'll amp it up at that point. Yeah, yeah. Just based on how the phases work, it gives us a lot of time to like get settled in and and see how the two players are doing in the e in the easier parts of the game. Yeah, I think they're settling into like just sending each other damage right now. Not really just going for Tetris. Yeah, we're it not... It is a bit messier right now. Yeah, we're not that close to 60,000 yet, but looks like Baseball Boy Zone's here. It might fall just short of 60,000, so in Phase 2 may still be in play after this is done. Uh, how much, how much more score do you get during zone? Oh, there we go. It did go over 60k. Oh, no. I see. It comes at the end. It, okay. it, it, it comes at the end, and I think... I think you get 100 points for each uh, zone line that you clear, along with all the damage bonuses you get. Oh, I see. Okay. But that, that's based on my... I'm making that guess based on what happens in single player, but... Uh, but here we saw uh, we saw the score jump by like 20k. So yeah, salted looking not as sharp. I think the banana is all wearing off. Indeed. 
and, and plus there's not that there's not as many rounds to work with so the, this could be all, oh oh that's not good wow yeah big chance for the uh, big chance for salted oh apm is exactly the same yo all right baseball boy dropping his weights his phone is weighing him down now he's at peak performance. Yeah, so Silver is asking about Dark Arts. Are they PC openers? Oh, they're different than the whole four-line PC opener they strategy. Are seven, eight-line PC openers, mm -hmm. I think. Yeah, the, the 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 triple doubles that we're talking about uh, as Dark Arts, those end up as eight-line perfect clears. So uh, I brought up the cl perfect clear aspect because that's one of the advantages to using it yeah they're just extremely versatile and one of them one of the aspects of that is very very high chance of oh nice pc ooh. from salted yeah. speaking of which uh yeah like one of the aspects of dark arts that make them so powerful is the ability to get like a high chance of pc yeah and it's very easy to see too so it's not like that's right Ooh, okay, 20 lines, but Baseball Boy took a little while to complete that, so not quite as effective. Yeah, because Salted had that zone plus all that stuff he was clearing while Baseball Boy was in his zone. Yeah, able to offset a lot. Indeed. Salted responds with another zone, but it's not as effective. So uh, Salted with the score lead here, he can... That he's probably going to be the one controlling when phase three starts. A bit of a mess on salted side, so the efficiency is going to drop a bit. Yeah, not much comboing going on either, so he can't really get good damage. Mm -hmm. Well, well, baseball it, boy is only first, so he may end up getting phase three. Oh, but his gaps are blocked. He's not oh. gonna get that many lines off of this. Yeah. Ah, uh, he's close. Ah, uh, bo both of them. Uh, both both of them stayed yeah. under 60k, so we're still on. We're still on a phase two right now. Salta takes damage here. This bodes well for him because it'll be phase two. It'll yeah. be phase two. It'll be two like up. not nasty yet. Now this is a surprise. Uh, the salt it's up 2-1. Oh, okay. Yeah, it may well be the case that uh, Baseball Boy overexerted himself as well mm -hmm. in their last bout. Indeed. Especially since it was the true finals and all. And I, I could see that for sure. I guess that's the reason why, like, last round, Baseball Boy didn't seem quite as sharp, because because he had a few T-spins, which seemed like he passed up, so... Yeah, I think he was, like, trying to think about something that was not important. Mm -hmm. yeah, he's a little distracted. Right. Well, that... Still knows his uh, SRS, at least. Yeah. Yeah, you, you think he would have went for that little interesting donation there? Because I saw a donation where you could have uh, did a, a J twist, uh, no L, yeah L twist to kick the piece in, and then you get your donation. Yeah, he might have done that it, if it were like maybe. Maybe I think he's thinking about like he's like trying to get his head into the game right now. Yeah. So he's just like trying to stick to the basics, sort of. He, he's still got a decent amount of time to get that going, so... Yeah. Ooh, Sultan's got a nice stack. Ooh, Fractal. Oh, uh, but it, well, his gaps are pretty, pretty blocked Yeah, it's gonna up, be hard so. to get down. Ah, uh, not good. Mm -hmm. Well, what Sultan needs to do right now is get through these lines that he didn't clear during the zone and try to get some zone meter out of it. Yeah, he does not want to get hit right now. Well, he has some zone to work with if he does get yeah. hit, but of course he's not going to... Baseball Boy has some spaghetti, so it's not... Salted is not in a terrible position. Yeah, now compared to Salted Zone there, uh, Baseball Boy managed to get quite a few lines there. 
Okay, nice cancel. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, Salta's bird still has the speed advantage, so he will catch up to Baseball Boy in terms of zone. That, that is true. We saw how we saw how Salted had pulled off a, a hundred uh, a hundred speed game last round. So. Mm, yeah, that's true. Pretty good. All right. Baseball Boy in phase three. Mm -hmm. Multiple hit. This is a good zone nice. from Salted, considering that it's going to cause phase three damage. This could be it for. Baseball boy, because oh, it, he's old as well. He knows that he can't accept that garbage. Oh, oh no. but he messes up. Oh, the same. I think it's over. Yeah, the huge upset. GG's. Oh, is it three games or four? It's three. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they, they, they he forgot. <laughs> yeah, they weren't quite sure themselves. Yeah, yeah. All right, good, good game. All right, good games. Yeah, baseball boy seems like he's a bit caught off guard there. Mm -hmm. I think he was like. Expecting like PPT like seven set seven game sets to like try to get his head back in, but he was like, yeah, he's like, oh wait, it's over. Yeah, it's yeah. A, it's a different kind of mindset, especially since uh, TEC games between the two players that are close and skilled, they'll go on for quite a while. Like, yes, I am very well aware.